Good morning, folks. This volcano eruption footage comes to us from Nicaragua. There are six countries in this region with significantly erupting volcanoes or those on high alert. The same system that knocked out my power exploded yesterday along the leading edge, producing two very rare tornadoes for New York City. Check out the pictures if you haven't seen them. Having a look at yesterday's rainfall records, Columbia, New York is on there with over an inch in 20 minutes, and Franklin, North Carolina seeing unusual flooding after two inches in an hour. Torcon doesn't look too bad today, but check their updates a bit later. We had a 6-point earthquake in Indonesia yesterday, registering as high as a 6.8 or 7.1 by local readings. We also had a 6-pointer near the Kamchatka Peninsula and a 4.4 in Djibouti, Africa. Checking out Sonoma, you see Thursday's gamma burst on the left, and down at the south of the map, you see one from very early this morning. Looking at the solar wind, the green, yellow, and orange are the temperature, speed, and density, and they are all relatively calm. Up top in the red, the BZ fluctuations are happening at low nanotesla. So what caused a noticeable rise in proton counts yesterday? You remember I showed you this yesterday, the little earth on the bottom right of the sun is where our magnetic connection is currently. This is an important energetic earth-sun relationship. Having a look at some of those connected areas, do you see the flaring? Maybe a bit hard to notice, but the brightest regions do get brighter here. We had multiple flares. Two were behind the limb, so we just registered one mostly, an M flare here, causing a brief radio blackout. You can see the ejecta here actually from the backside blast, not coming anywhere near Earth, but the magnetic connection ruled the day and proton bombardment followed. Flares on our connection are always relevant. Having a look at the last 24 hours, trailing those active regions is a couple coronal holes. One sunspot on the north and a whole lot of open space. Looking at Stereo B to see what's coming, some more massive coronal holes. So in the spirit of coronal holes and Mercury here about to conjoin the Sun, here are some significant heliocentric and geocentric positions coming up soon. I'll leave you with more complete footage of that volcano. That's the news, folks. Be safe.